if you pay attention, all of our insecurities really come from judgment. If we were never told we were too fat, too skinny, too ugly, then we would never really know the feeling of insecurity. But the law of opposites makes us look through a greater than, less than microscope. And then we are still dealing with our taught thought and we apply that to our idea of what is greater than or less than in other people. During this process, compassion has been taken out of most judgments and we start severing our ties to each other. I honestly believe that we are all here to be a mirror for each other. But most of us have been psychologically damaged because we have been traumatized by people that are supposed to love us. So now instead of embracing our reflection in the mirror, we learn to identify with the cracks seen in our reflection. Our world has taught us that we really need to ignore our tears and develop thick skin. But as a person who is very in touch with her emotions, I have learned also that thick skin is a reality of our world not having compassion for each other. The irony is this lack of compassion has created an emotional instability within us. We are told we can't be who we are or who we want to become without compassion. We are told we can't make mistakes without compassion. And now most of us have grown without properly being watered with compassion into these critical beings who can't see people's mistakes through the eyes of our heart. And since we have learned to defend our traumas or the cracks in our reflection that can be repaired, we actually end up becoming an enemy to our own growth. We end up being the cause of our own suffering and fighting the watering of love that grows us. But when we start embracing the love from within and start to see the world through the eyes of our heart, we start loving the image of our own mirror. We start repairing the cracks that we can while embracing our journey of self-love, who we are and who we are becoming. I must say my biggest lesson out of all of this and this journey of self-love and discovery in our world is acknowledging loving myself finally, but also acknowledging the lack of love in our world and my place in restoring it because we all have a place in this age of Aquarius to restore our world. So may you become, may you grow at your own pace and acknowledge the wisdom within yourself that is telling you that it is time to grow. When you can't be watered by those around you, may you water yourself because you are the light that we need and you are a reflection of everything around you. I thank you, a legal lesson.